the School of Business and Leadership is approaching its one year anniversary. So let's take a step back and look at what's been going on this year. This is the newly renovated space that we opened in concert with the launching of the new School of Business and Leadership. This space in Harrison Hall is a focal area for students from across the campus. So rather than being a place off in a corner somewhere that only business students go to, this is really another hub on the campus that serves everybody. The School of Business and Leadership was created under the three school model strategy. This is a different strategy than other universities are following. So although we've created schools, we're not creating rigorous siloed structures. We're not preventing people from accessing things. The School of Business and Leadership is open to all students at DePaul. And my goal as Dean is to impact the educational outcomes of every student, not just the students that happen to be pursuing a major or a minor in the school. People are especially excited when they hear that we're delivering business education in an inclusive way, as in it's not just to business majors, but to all students at DePaul. They're also excited that we're doing it in the context of liberal arts. So the launch of the new school included the launch of two new majors. The faculty added finance and business analytics to economics and actuarial science. We've picked majors that are in very high demand and we see there being a lot of demand for in the future. One of the greatest ways that the School of Business and Leadership has impacted my experience here at DePaul is all the ways that it's given me the opportunity to be a better leader on campus and within the Greencastle community. So a big focus at DePaul is developing leadership skills in all of our students and we do that by allowing students to experience being leaders in many different roles. In addition to all those co-curricular, living, learning communities, societies, clubs and organizations organizations where students develop leadership skills, they can also do a minor in leadership. This allows students to understand more about how leadership has shaped society and how leadership frameworks work in different contexts. I recently started becoming interested in learning various new technologies that are currently used in industry and one of them is Bloomberg, which is a software that is used to track various stock and trading enterprises and I'm so grateful that here at the School of Business and Leadership, the Poor has provided equipment for us to be able to learn and get to experience this new skill. Bloomberg allows students to access this really unprecedented amounts of data and information. As students become familiar with these tools, they'll learn how they can evaluate data and understand how to use it. Now typically you'd see those on financial traders desks or financial analysis desks. Any student can get Bloomberg certified as a part of these terminals. So that's a qualification that a student could complete on their own and then add to their resume. I think the fact that a student might do a co-curricular program like Management Fellows whilst pursuing a major in uh, the creative school whilst doing a minor in liberal arts is just tremendously exciting and something you just wouldn't find at another institution.